case of thromboangitis obliterans and he has gangrene uh, in his left grade 2 and ultrasound suggests a big block of the cephalofemoral artery. So I have marked certain landmarks. This is the posterior pelvic spine on both the sides. This is the top of the iliac crust. We have drawn a line, a dotted blue line that indicates that this line is passes between the L5, L5 and L4. We have marked L4, L3, L2, spinous process of the lumbar vertebra. We have marked the 12th rib and we have taken a point from the midline 6 cm away. This point is roughly in between these two landmarks and the distance is 6 cm. So this is the entry point for the lumbar sympathetic block. Initially you just anesthetize the entry point of the needle by a small uh, 31 gauge needle. And the other ki. Bas. Just inject in a subcutaneous plane and wait for a few seconds and then and then withdraw to dermal level and then give a intradermal injection. Wait, wait and wait. Now this is complete here. You can notice a dermal blab that indicates that total skin get anesthetized and little bit softness tissue also. This are 30, uh, 20, uh, 1 gauge needle just to make a puncture here. Make a skin puncture here because the skin of the back is quite thick. See, it needs a lot of resistance just to make a puncture here. And then yes, just remove it. Remove it. Now, pass this needle. Uh, at 30 days now I have taken a 20 uh, gauge uh, need a spinal needle and the length of this needle is 9 centimeters so I will insert the needle if needle strikes the transverse process at 3 about 2 to 3 centimeter depth then you move the needle either the cranially or quarterly to bypass the transverse process so, now insert the needle from the same punctured point this is already punctured point yes it has gone in now so this is 90 degree this is 90 degree so just tilt this this angle should be 80 degree and this should be uh, 100 degree so little cranial this is little the tip of the needle is towards the midline now withdraw to skin level skin level and from here you insert the needle if there is some pain discomfort if touches the somatic nerve just withdraw the needle and tilt it cranially or quarterly so just withdraw it withdraw it and tilt this needle little cranially or quarterly Now about 7 cm has gone inside, so remove this easily. So I have taken a uh, 3 ml syringe just for the sake of the resistance, inject and then advance the needle, aspirate and then inject. This should go nearly the full depth of the needle will, will go inside. This all there is no springy sensation. Just going, yes. On the check. Now 9 centimeters inside. Now check for the back flow. Further advance the needle little bit. 
देखते के लिए चुके हैं दिस इज ऑल फ्री एंड देयर इज नो एस्प्रिट नो एस्प्रिट एंड फ्री नाउ ही आई इन ट्वेंटी एम एल ऑफ द सोल्यूशन आई हैव ऑलरेडी इंजेक्टेड थ्री एम एल सो टेक इन दी डी सुरेंज जस्ट लॉक इट स्टेबलाइज एंड इंजेक्ट देर शुड नॉट बी एनी रेजिस्टेंस कीप वॉच ऑन पल्स एंड ऑल्सो इन टच विद द पेशेंट वर्बल कंटेक्ट दादा ठीक है गो स्लो रोटेट एस्परेट मूव एस्परेट रोटेट एंड देन इंजेक्ट एवरीथिंग इज पल्स इज स्टेबल पेशेंट इज कंफर्टेबल होल लेंथ ऑफ द नीडल इज नाइन सेंटीमीटर गॉन इन साइड दिस इज ए एवरेज बिल्ड पेशेंट इज नॉट वेरी ओवीज नॉट वेरी थिन सो दिस मस्ट लेंथ इज सफिशियंट एंड ओवीज पेशेंट यू हैव टू टेक ट्वेल्व सेंटीमीटर लॉन्ग नीडल एटलीस्ट सो आई हैव कंप्लीटेड द ब्लॉक ऑन द लंबर सेंपथेटिक ब्लॉक ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड नाउ रिमूव द स्टिलीट So remove, sorry, remove this syringe. And this fluid is coming. The back fluid is is coming. So now remove it. The whole length is inside. Now check for the. Now I will examine the patient for the warmness. and the dilatation of the vessels on the left side we will wait for 15 to 20 minutes and we will see the response of it. 